Today, Sudden Death, otherwise known as Danny Howland, released a single for the first time in over a year, actually. The last release was Utah, which was in uh, August of 2020. So, <laughs> like, I've been waiting for this guy to make some more music for a while. And, uh, yay! He's got a new single. Okay, I'm gonna live react to it because I have no clue what to expect from it. Um, yeah, so he recently, like a couple months ago, announced Void Volume 2, which is this like EP kind of series he's had going on. And um, I mean, any activity from Danny at all is a great sign in my opinion. I love his music, so I have high expectations for this one. Very medieval kind of theme I already hear in this. I think that's pretty sick. These visuals are actually pretty dope. And I, I will have the YouTube video instead of the um, Spotify in the description because these, these visuals are pretty dope actually. how it just like, just turned into nothing for a bit. Like that was a kind of lazy transition, but it worked uh, all right, I guess. I really liked like the almost stab kind of 808s, so whatever you want to call that, going on throughout the drop, it was like, Poof. and I really liked that, I thought it was really cool, and the lead itself, um, the pattern was very simple, but effective, I hope you can hear me and it's not drowning me out. kind of ends like that I guess um, I've been looking for more more mo like a more melodic approach from Danny ever since the losing it edit with Somnium sound that second the second drop of that edit is like literally heaven it is one of the best things I've ever heard and while this is not nearly as good as that drop it still kind of has the same feel to it I guess for the second drop of course um, yeah, it's, it's not bad, but it's 
Like it's good. It's very good, and it's great to see activity from Danny again. Um, yeah, this is just a really nice way to kind of say, "Hey, I haven't died. Here's some more great music." Although I really kind of hope, like, I I have a lot of expectations from this guy. Like, I love him a lot in terms of his music, and um. This wasn't a disappointment per se, but it wasn't exactly like, oh my god, this is his best song yet. So, I, I'm, I have no, nothing wrong, like, I have no opinion on this song that is bad. This is, I can't find anything I don't like about it. Maybe I will <laughs> in the future, but on that first listen, I liked it. Quite a bit. I will, uh... Listen to this a lot in preparation for Void Volume 2. I cannot wait for Void Volume 2. Like, I, I seem really unexcited about it, and I don't sound like I'm actually excited about it, but I am really excited for Void Volume 2. The tr teaser for it was absolutely mental. It was so cool. The, like, the announcement teaser, if you haven't seen it, I'll also link it. It was so cool. Yeah, I really can't have no much else to say about this, honestly. I'm not great at reviewing things, so... But I really wanted to react to this, because I love Sun Death, and to see him active again is honestly just a massive gift. This is like early Christmas for me. I'm like a kid on Halloween getting a piece of candy. This, it is good. I don't have much else to say. Bye.